final we have all been waiting for. Two of the best going head to head. Don't go anywhere. All the action coming up next on EA TV. And what a test for these two sides as they meet in the final of the UEFA Women's Champions League. It is Manchester City versus Manchester United. Well, it's been a long journey for both these teams, Derek. It's not been easy, but these players are 90 minutes away from making history for themselves. No doubt both managers will have set out their game plans and made sure every player knows exactly what their roles are. What a game we have in store for us. And here's the Manchester City lineup. Well, I think they have a nice balance to their team. A solid back four, two holding midfielders, three creative players in advance of them, and a mobile centre forward. It's a good team. United. Well, the shape is the same, but they may play it in a slightly different way. And key to this game will be the fullbacks. Do they tuck in alongside their centre halves or look to support their wingers? I hope it's the latter. And so the battle commences. A very good tackle. They've given it away. Alex Greenwood. Lauren Hem. It might be. And saved by the keeper. Intense pressure. And given away. She just doesn't want to give the ball away. And in with a real chance. Off the post and back in play. Would have been lovely bit of inventive play, but just off target. Clean challenge. Close. 
not great from the keeper. Lad. And that puts him in position. A very timely interception. And they do like to press whenever they can. Khadija Shaw. Now oh, that's wonderful attacking play. It might be the moment to get them ahead. Really digging in at the back. But still the opportunity. Well, not great defending. Must take the lead here. And that's how to deal with finesse. Well, it's an easy save for the keeper. It wasn't the best option, that's for sure. Intercepted it. Gives us legends to learn from and pushes us to become better. It dares us to take risks and impact those And the pass was just that little bit off. Nearly found its target. You can wreck your childhood club and wear any colour. Well, that challenge was overly robust, to say the least. Now we look towards the referee. What will her decision be? Possession one. Well, good looking play with the ball of defeat. Khadija Shaw. Chloe Kelly. The fans imploring her to shoot. And a chance for them to nudge in front. Well, I think you could call that an escape. It looked a certain goal. Alessia Russo. Now they're on the scent of something positive. Struggling to keep the ball. Promising looking attack. And getting the better of a marker. Well, not cleared away completely. Superb defensive judgment to end the attack. Well, she keeps moving and struggling to get the shot off well no danger now and beating her opponent chance here well that could have been the opener well it looked for all the world to be the opening goal her finishing has to be better than that Soon. It's looking promising, and the cross not quite imaginative enough. Moving forward effectively. And splendid goalkeeping. Well, it's a decent attempt, but in the end, not enough. And as you say, good goalkeeping. Well, they're finishing, as the stats confirm, has been wasteful. Which is a shame, because their build-up play has been really inventive. They just need to be more clinical in front of goal. Nicely timed tackle. And plenty of scope to be creative in that wide position. Cross towards that far post. Well, it didn't really work the keeper when all was said and done. Soon. 
limits that will outmast us. Uh, making that dream move. Yet again, there to intercept. This might be the perfect counter-attacking opportunity. And whipped into the box. Oh, what a goal! Right out of the top drawer! Who could do better than that? Well, here it is again. And all you can do is admire the skill. That's a really clever goal, you have to say. So underway again here, 1-0 the score. Russo, good tackle, take it away. Useful looking ball, and just slightly offside. And Manchester City will go to their bench. And she moves the ball with intent. It needs an accurate cross. Out of play for a Manchester City throw in. Well, she really deserves credit for that challenge. City move it forward with purpose. And credit is due for that good piece of defending. Good work to regain possession. Boxing her opponent. Oh, it's mischievous. And a really fine piece of goalkeeping. Well, I'm not sure that was the right decision. Easy save in the end. And one minute of stoppage time has been added on. Can she score? And pushed away to safety. The first half here comes to an end. Well, it might well. The second half is underway, and it's Manchester City with the lead. defending but brilliant defending soon and the counter looks on here options available and it looks highly promising but it came to nothing in the end played into the center not the best clearance and there it is a two-goal cushion now and just look at these fans the trophy coming their way, surely. Well, just look at this again. Great technique, perfect contact, and a brilliant finish. Top stuff. So the ball rolling again. 2-0 the score.
Well, the attacking options appear plentiful. Takes the shot. A goal as they cut into their advantage. Still plenty of life in this match. Well, here you can see it again. Good run, great strength, and a composed finish under pressure. That's a top-class goal. So the match continues, and United just one behind here. And the advantage is with City. Opportunity! Well, not to be for her in front of goal. Well, that's a poor miss in what was a great situation. It's still in the balance here. Haley Ladd. And teammates around her. Oh, the threat is there. Could be. Couldn't quite hang on. Well, nothing comes of it. Well, I don't think they've been at it today, but maybe, just maybe, that great save will inspire them now. And the free kick awarded to Manchester United. Well, can they be creative from here? Fed over towards the back post. Well, that is quite simply a tremendous stop. Well, you have to praise the goalkeeper there. That is absolutely brilliant. The way she makes the save, you couldn't get any better than that. And over comes the corner. And the problem not completely solved. Going for the dink. And a really fine piece of goalkeeping. Well, I'm not sure that was the right decision. Easy save in the end. We have 30 minutes to go. And running it back. Oh, fancy footwork. But a good piece of tidying up. Turner. Soon. And possession given away. One that spirit can't be broken. From this close, I just the conscious teammates. Oh, that's a really good run. And up for grabs off the keeper. Well, no damage done. Setting a bar for the next generation to be. Well, United are getting closer to leveling the game here. They're certainly making chances, but that was a terrific stop to keep them at bay. Well, now they've got to concentrate on keeping the door locked. Struggling to get it away. It's going to be United's free kick. But yeah. Tremendous intuition to win it back. Steph Halton. Kelly. In position. And a good save. Well, it is a good save. The idea was good. The execution wasn't. Soon. On a bad year. Good movement. But it fizzles out thanks to that piece of defending. Just 20 minutes remaining now. Well, far from the ideal pass. Kelly. Well, nicely cut out. Now, what can they do with the ball? Now, just the tackle that was needed.
great opportunity. Oh, it's cheeky. And excellent goalkeeping. Well, it is good goalkeeping, but the finish wasn't really good enough, was it? They've given it away. Now a potentially dangerous position for City. A glorious chance. And you almost might say that was creative goalkeeping. It certainly was. She did so well to get down. She got out quickly, snuffed out the danger. That's why she's a top-class keeper. And the free kick awarded to Manchester United. She has teammates around her. But nothing comes of it. Good defending it was. Now can they counter clinically? All hands on deck. And both hands on it. Good goalkeeping. Haley Ladd. Russo. Manchester United know they've got to get on the front foot with time the enemy. And a promising looking attack, but comes to nothing in the end. Asagawa. Running with the ball confidently. Couldn't keep it. In a position from which they could potentially do a bit of damage here. They simply couldn't beat the first defender. And a throw in here for United. Here's a change for Manchester United. Maya Letizier. Like making that dream move a reality. We're setting a bar for the next generation to be. Options in the centre. And not quite on target, unfortunate, you've got to say. Yeah, a little bit unfortunate. It's good technique. She makes good contact, but it needs to be on target to trouble the keeper. A change in the offing for City. Kelly. And that was a very fine read. The clock is against Manchester United here, but the dreams remain alive. A really top-notch piece of defending. We've had the official word, there will be a minimum of two added minutes. This looks promising. A real opening now. Oh no, couldn't beat the goalkeeper. And there goes the final whistle. The cup issue is settled. A story of one side celebrating and the other distraught. Memories are being made. Well, just look at those scenes down there, Derek. What a contrast in emotions. Brilliant for the winners, despair for the losers. But overall, the right team won today. Yeah, you can see what it means to this tight-knit team. Real solidarity. Well, this is special for everybody at the club. What a great moment for any young player. And this is what you dream about when you start playing football. When you're playing in the playground, you want to win a cup. Brilliant moment. It's a special moment in the career of any footballer. And now for the trophy lift itself. The cup winners. Well, you can just see what it means to those players and the manager. That's fantastic stuff. There's always the element of chance in a cup competition. But my goodness, they've taken the rough with the smooth. And now they savour the moment. Full marks to the entire team, and now they get the chance to exhale and enjoy. They've been brilliant in this competition, and so have the fans. They've really got behind their team. They've played a big part in this win. Just look at those faces in the crowd. Great stuff. 
It's really a match made in heaven between players and fans. And these celebrations are going to continue for quite some time. And now the players get to relax a bit and enjoy having the pictures taken. Well, these photos will be cherished for years to come, won't they? Certainly ones to show the grandchildren. And now they get the ball rolling. <laughs> 